Hi, Wes Bryan here, Edutainer at IT Pro TV, and we're coming at you with another great edition of How to Get Started in IT. Is certification right for you? Are you even required to get certified? We're going to take a look in this episode. Meet Jamie. Jamie was in a dead-end job with a very high turnover rate. Jamie does a little detective work and finds that a few positions require certification to be hired. So Jamie decides to pursue certification. Jamie passes the certification exams and becomes certified. Jamie approaches the organization about the position and is hired. <laughs> now, let's consider Riley. Riley's been working at an organization for three years in a junior position. Riley has overheard that a senior position is opening up in the organization. However, the position requires certification. Riley takes certification by taking online training, like we have at IT Pro TV. The new certifications combined with the experience makes Riley a perfect fit for the position. Riley's situation, certification was a factor, and I'd say that Riley made the right choice. Now, let's go ahead and consider Drew. Drew's been working for an organization that is getting ready to deploy a new technology. Drew's company does not currently have anyone to support the new technology, and Drew wants the position. Drew takes online training and learns the new technology, like we offer at IT Pro TV. And when the training is complete, Drew has gained the confidence to support the organization's deployment. Drew's organization needed rapid deployment and support, so certification wasn't required. So, should you certify or not? Identify your goals. What are your goals? If you're in Jamie's shoes, certification is required to obtain the new position. If we think back to Riley, Riley's position to get the promotion, certification was also required. If you're in Drew's position, the focus wasn't certification. It was just to learn the new technology. If you like what you've seen today, be sure to subscribe. And, well, is certification right for you or not? Leave us a comment below because your voice matters. And for all of us here at How To Get Started In IT, I've been your host, Wes Bryan. We'll see you next time.